my fellow tech junkies? It's me, Elric, your host here on the Tech Mar YouTube channel, bringing you guys an unboxing and first look for us of something new from the people over at Danger Den. What is this? This is one of their latest water cooling heat blocks for the new LGA 2011 platform. It's pretty cool. It's solid copper, features a nickel top, comes to the market at about $80, and this is what the bad boy looks like in the box. You guys take a little close look at that. Not too much to it, it's actually a box. There are two components to this when you order it. You get the box and you get all of these components. So that said, let's shift over the table now and let's show you actually what comes in the box. All right guys, so here we have it. This is the DDM6 CPU cooler from the great folks over at Danger Den. Just wanna thank you guys for shipping this out to me. Like usual, I got my trusty knife. The old Punisher knife, ooh wait, that's right. I'm going to go ahead and make an incision here. Never try this at home, folks. No, I'm just kidding. Just be careful if you try it at home. So we'll go ahead and we'll pop the top here. Right on the top, we have the Danger Den. Let's go ahead and open it up. This is their instruction manual. I've heard good things about this company. I'm really looking forward to working with them. This is going to be the replacement, actually, for... One of the things we're using the test lab, our 2011, we have the basic Intel retail one that came with it. We want to move past that and try some others. And the first company we thought of right now was Danger Den. So this is the Danger Den M6 CPU block installation guide. Has a lot of different images, shows you how to do it. Looks pretty straightforward. Then we have the Danger Den overclocking water cooling case mods. Gives you even more information on how to change stuff. This is part of the mounting hardware right here, but then there's some awesome additional fittings, so I'm gonna bring those into the light right here. These are the DDM6 performance enhancing shims. The different colors, I mean the different thicknesses. Here are where you connect your hoses and everything onto these. And then we have an additional one right here. So there's different stuff right here. We'll move on, get to the block. It's really cool they can, that they give you all the compression fittings and everything in the box. I just think it's really great with these guys. Some people don't. Go ahead and set these down right here. Here's the block. As we said before, it's nickel plated on top. You have an inlet here, the out here. Hence where you're gonna be using these or this, depending on which way you wanna go. So now let's look at the base. As we said before, it's going to have a solid copper inlay right there. You can see that. Very nice looking. This should be a very excellent product. I'm really hoping that when I order their dual rad, which I'm gonna be beginning in a few days, we're gonna go ahead and use this. Now, let me get the camera just to move back over here real quick. Follow, follow me if you would, Mr. Cameraman, sir. This is our LGA 2011 platform. Currently, right now, we have the Intel standard that came with it. But now we're gonna start testing a bunch of water blocks, starting out with Danger Den. We're also gonna be working with EK and Swift Tech, and we're gonna be doing just a lot of different testing. So what we're going to do is we're going to remove this completely. We're going to put a dual radiator back here in the back, and then we're gonna set up different blocks on here, starting off, like, like I said, the Danger Den DDM6. So here you have it, folks. Here's everything that comes in the box of Danger Den's latest DDM6 CPU cooler, built for the LGA 2011 platform, featuring a solid copper bottom and a nickel plated top. But today, we just brought you the unboxing. So thanks for being with us here on the Tech of Tomorrow YouTube channel. We'll see you folks back here tomorrow.